not used to this, so, you know. Right, good afternoon, far away from friends. On behalf of Dave and myself, I would like to welcome David into our family and hope that he can cope with the strange... <laughs> I would like to welcome those who have travelled a great distance to be with us today, and also those who have come from around the corner. Perhaps we should have a prize for those who have come the furthest. Watching Janet grow <laughs> through the years, I have all but given up on the hope of walking her down the aisle. <laughs> Thank you, David, for making an old man very happy. <laughs> or oh, making a happy man so very old. <laughs> <laughs> Janet has always had a mind of her own. And I know she's got round to marrying marry one of those days. Well, it's better late than never. <laughs> Getting to know David over the last year, we have seen their love blossom, and I feel sure that it will continue to grow through their lives together. We are sure that David's presence... Patience. Patience, sorry. <laughs> Would you all be upstanding and join me in wishing the bride Unsuitable fish. I found wrong plenty of fish, which is a dating site. 
Uh, Uncle Keith again for being such a generous person. Uh, Gian and Colin for being so generous for their time and their maids of honour. Uh, did you bring any? Very nice one. Um, and these, this pair for underwriting this whole shindy. Um, my mum and dad are giving us a honeymoon to remember on the Isle of Man. Uh, my sister-in-law Joe and my brother Stephen, well, they gave us a car, uh, which was very useful because it's needed for my work. Uh, and I'd like to thank Bifo and Harrogate, which is a homeless charity, who have just given me a job. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> that job starts on April 30th, which is two weeks' time, and it gives us a stable income for the future. Uh, we were a little bit dicey back there, weren't we? Uh, and it, last and most, is Jan, my dear bride, so being loving, kind, and gentle, <laughs> and all that stuff. Five minutes. <laughs> I'll be here for an hour, come on. Oh no, I've only got three pieces left. Um, anyway, I'm going to bring this check of heaven before God. Um, I got the impression that uh, you ain't seen nothing yet. Uh, so, uh, given the blessing so far, I'm sure the next one will really knock us off. Uh, and I missed someone off the list I gave earlier. There are two people present whom I doubt Janet would not have made it up the aisle. Uh, Terry and Aileen. So, ladies and gentlemen, I give you the bridesmaids. <laughs> I was talking earlier about blessings, and this man over here uh, has been a blessing and a half. Our friendship blossomed at the church in the Thursday Bible group, which now meets on a Wednesday. Um, and I'd like to thank him for being my best man today. And so I'll hand you over to Mike to do his bit. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Will. Um, being as some of us are, 
do all of us for a while. Uh, good Christians and members of the church, well, I'm not taking anything for granted. Uh, I would just like to acknowledge the presence of God in what, what took place a little while ago. I, that was a wedding of David and Janet. His hand in what's happening now and his love, not just for us, for a special couple, but for all of us as we move forward in our lives. And it's just a very, very short prayer. You don't have to close your eyes or anything. I just, I just said, Lord God, I thank you for your presence here today and all our days. I pray for your continued love and blessing on us all. And now, David, <laughs> a few words about you. <laughs> <laughs> and they will be relatively few, I promise. Uh, we haven't actually known each other very long, so you'll all be doubtless quite pleased that I'm not able to recount these past deeds or misdemeanors. Or <laughs> um, I've got to know David fairly well now, and uh, the, David is a highly intelligent and educated man. Uh, just ask him, and I'm sure he'll agree with you. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, David and myself, David's mentioned this already a little bit, and Gail and sometimes Helen meet regularly in Bible study prayer and quite often to discuss our trials and tribulations, which is great. Uh, and this is an important bit. In the early days, when before we really got to know David a bit better, he said he didn't think he was ready for things like emotions and love. As clearly demonstrated today, he was absolutely wrong. <laughs> anyway, that's enough of me getting my own back. In that time, I got to know David pretty well. And as Gil to testify, a while ago, I put my hand in his shoulder and I said, I love you, man. His reply was, well, okay then, I love you too, but no kissing. <laughs> yeah. In short, the, the David I know is a very good Christian indeed, and a man of the highest integrity, a man well suited to be Janet's husband, and I'm honoured to ask me to be his best man. Janet? I don't know you quite so well, but I can see a warm and loving personality. And I wish you health, wealth, if possible, and every happiness for your future together. Now, David's already mentioned it, but I'm going to mention it too, because I've written it down. But lastly, probably a lot of people already know this, and now, of course, you all know, David very recently was successful in being accepted for a job he really wanted. And all I can say about that, it's a burden lifted. Our God is good. Mm -hmm. and I've been asked to read, there's quite a few messages. Uh, no, just the ones that Matt's in red. You want me to skip the rest? Yeah, just yes, the ones that are in red. Right, who? Otherwise, you'll be there all day. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'll wait some time. <laughs> yes, I'm sure you will. Yeah. Well, you can see there's about five pages here, so there's a lot of good wishes on the way. <laughs> this is one I have to read, it's from Jackie Patterson. Have a wonderful wedding, Janet Walker and David. <coughs> Wishing you health, wealth, and every happiness. Wishing Janet Walker and David Cheesborough all the very best for their wedding tomorrow. I really hope the weather stays good for you both. Enjoy your special day. Can't wait to see the photos. Love from us all. <laughs> and more kisses than I can count on one hand. <laughs> <laughs> and, yes, finally, from Catherine Nicholl. My Scottish toast to you both. May the best you've ever seen be the worst you'll ever see. May the mouse never leave your pantry with a teardrop in his eye. May you always keep healthy and hearty until you're old enough to cry. May you always be just as happy as we wish you now to be. And uh, 
It's almost it for me. I just ask you to raise your glasses once again to Janet and David, the bride and groom. Bride and groom. Your big day is here, your birth will 